Hi everyone, I'm Megan from Alder and Nance, and today I wanted to share with you this week's project from Violet Field Threads. We are working on their Bailey overalls for my youngest daughter Ryan's 10th birthday using this beautiful 100% cotton fabric that was embroidered with bumblebees that I picked up from Joann's. Now why this fabric? Ryan has fallen in love with bees and beekeeping and for her birthday everything was bee related. We even picked up local honey to make honey cupcakes with a honey buttercream frosting. Now, I know that you are not here for all of that, so let's dive into my thoughts on the Bailey overalls. The Bailey overalls from Violet Fields Third is available in a 2T all the way up to a children's size 910. We went with the 910 size, which has a bust of 27, a waist of 25, and a hip of 29 and a half, which has a finished waist measurement of 31 inches. This pattern is quick and easy to put together. My only downfall for getting this project done was actually my Burnett machine's fault as it didn't want to sew the buttonholes. I also didn't make a mock-up of the project so I would have liked to grade it out at least one size and use a stretchier fabric. Ryan has been saying for a while now that she wanted a pair of overalls so she had a lot of say in making this project. So when I found this fabric, everything fell into place. So I'll be linking down below to Joann's and also to Violet Filled Threads where you can pick up this pattern. Now, will I be making this again? Yes. And I'll be grading out the side seams and probably drop the crotch for her just a tiny bit. As for the front and back facings, I might do an all-in-one facing next time so that the armholes don't need bias binding. So I'll just be copying the front and back down about two inches from the armholes. The bees on this are almost an inch wide. So when I made her buttons, I used the largest button set I had. And the buttonhole was the largest that my Eversome machine could make. Violet Field Threads has full color instructions on how to make this project. So yes, I would suggest going ahead and picking up this pattern and making it for yourself. Now... I don't have a lot left to say on this, so if you want to go ahead and jump through to the reveal, I'll leave a timestamp right here for you. Otherwise, just enjoy a little bit of music and watch me finish making this project and then you'll be able to see the reveal.